Good morning, everyone. Uh, it looks like we actually just got an update in the Lucky Block Legends game. So we just came in here. Actually, our servers just reset. And it kind of threw us into a random server. So uh, basically what it says is new fall zone, a magical egg, new event egg, and two times coins. So that's pretty awesome. So let's go check out what the fall zone is and the magical and the new event egg is. And hopefully we didn't lose all of our event eggs that we had because I had saved about 1,300 of them. So let's go check those out. So let's look here first. Oh, dang it. It did take them away. That's not cool. Okay, well, lesson learned. I should have actually taken care of those then before uh, before the the update was going to happen. So good to know. Um, but let's go and take a look at the new fall zone here. Just one second. All right. So let's go back over to the fall event. Let's actually check a couple things before we go and look at the new area. Let's go see what's in the merchant, see if there's something else in there. Nope, so same item still in the merchant, but I do see right here on the screen there is a new free huge. And basically what you have to do is play for three hours, hatch 5,000, oh, we're gonna restart again. So just kidding, hold on just a second. <laughs> Let's see where we land. All right, so we just landed back in another server, so we're gonna try that again. So as I was saying, there is a new free huge. You can play for three hours, you have to hatch 5,000 eggs, break 1,000 lucky blocks. Um, so it shouldn't be too difficult to get that. And then let's see if my eggs came back. Nope, they didn't. I was hoping that that update that they just did was going to replenish my, my eggs, but it didn't. So um, as you can see, there's also no new UGC. So I kind of thought maybe that was going to be it also. But because of the fact that I just lost those almost 1,300 eggs, I'm going to complete these spins because that tells me that we'll probably lose those as well when they do do an update for the... Uh, UGC. So anyways, let's go back to the fall events. Jump over here. As I said, um, there is nothing new in the merchant. Well, maybe there is now. Let's go just double check it since it did update again. Nope, nothing new and nothing changed as far as the prices go. So I was hoping that the prices would come down for that secret, but they didn't. So that's kind of a bummer, but that's okay. So we still have the Autumn Hydra. I'm kind of surprised that's still there. Um, nothing changed over here by the leaderboard. <clears throat> so nothing exciting there. Let's run down here to the end of this world and see what the new area is. Luckily, I've saved a ton of these leaf coins, so um, we won't hopefully have a problem getting into it. Oh, what's that? Hey, what is that? I can't even break that. So there's this little red block sitting here in the middle of nowhere, and I've never seen that before. So that's kind of interesting. Don't know what that is, but um, okay. Hi, little red block. Um, that's kind of funny. Anyways, let's go check out this new area. See what's going on down there. Um, ancient forest costs 800 billion. No problem, I have 279 trillion. Let's go. All right, so it looks like just some more blocks. Obviously there's quite a few big blocks in here, which that's kind of cool. And let's see what's in this egg. So we've got new, uncommon, legendary, uh, probably a secret, and then another egg within the egg. I like those because that's the one that you could get the uh, poisonous mushroom out of in the last area. You could also get um, a lot of other really cool things as well. And then there is a new huge in here and a new giant. I'm not sure what they are because obviously we haven't hatched it yet, so have no idea. Um, but look at these new blocks in here. So there's a giant blue, red, and green block. And then around it, there's also some other little blocks that you can break as well. So I think probably the best new place to be auto farming would be in this area. So we're definitely gonna do that. It looks like some of my friends are already jumping in here, which is cool. Um, so we're going to go ahead and turn the auto farm on as well. Hopefully when these break, um, contrary to kind of how the last giant gold block broke, hopefully it'll actually give people, everybody who's actually breaking it, some coins or, you know, the reward basically, because that's not how the last one works. So I guess we'll kind of see what happens with these ones once multiple people start, start farming them and what happens with that. But so that looks like that's what the update is. Um, so again, new new dog egg and the event eggs. Um, so pretty cute. That's a really cute little giant they got there. Um, there still is the season one patch you can keep doing, obviously. Um, I'm actually over to level 22 right now on this particular one. And then let's take a look in the shop. Oh, there's a new magical egg too. Wow, that's really cool. So it looks like another Dominus, uh, but I'm not sure which one this actually is. So. Um, but that is definitely two new huges as well in there. And then obviously a bunch of little, little um, 
Love exclusive pets to actually hatch as well. Um, let's check out and see if there's anything else new in the shop. Doesn't look like it. Let's look at the gem portion. So still the same items in the gem one. You can still get the egg and the huge diamond bee and then uh, the little guy for the, the uh, event pet. So that's kind of what the update is right now. And uh, so check it out, guys. Hope you guys are having fun. Um, I hope you guys hatched all of your event eggs before the update like I did not. Um, but good luck, everyone. Hope you're having a great time. Make sure you like and subscribe and have a great day. See you soon.